Yum, yum. Floyd here with a quick look at gradient layers in Moto, which enable you to modify a gradient channel in place by evaluating a stack of layers from the bottom up to modify the gradient curve. For this example, I'll start with a simple toroid primitive and add a push mesh up to the mesh up stack and increase the distance attribute. Next, I'll add a radial fall off to the tool pipe and increase the strength attribute. To access the gradient layers viewport, add a new tab and choose data list gradient layers. Open the easing gradient for the radial falloff in the gradient editor. And with the gradient channel selected, click add layer in the gradient layers viewport. There are several gradient layer types to choose from. And for this example, I'll choose noise, then increase the amplitude attribute for the noise. The base gradient is evaluated and the value is passed to the noise layer and the final computed value is output from the channel. You can add additional layers on top of each other and reorder them by dragging them in the viewport, which enables you to produce a wide range of effects. Oh, look at the time. <laughs>